going on guys it's king champ bringing you another draft champions in madden 16. there is some exciting news today in draft champions is that they put flashbacks in draft champions so this is your chance to try out some cards so let's jump into it we're gonna pick the new orleans coach for long pass because i love the long pass so let's see if we can pull mike vick if we do oh i'll be going crazy in the first round we get oh there we see we get the flashback do well dock it that car looks nasty but i've gotten burned lately the secondary so i'm gonna definitely take cam chancellor secondary you gotta draft i've gotten burned i'd go linebackers but that's wrong play and see we get a right guard or we can go we just drafted a strong safe so we're gonna go with tj long my boys packers represent there we go we're gonna start out pretty good oh ryan matthews it's not a bad back, but I don't mean we have Reddick, and we definitely need a quarterback. Um, we're going to take a center. We had That was a shitty round. So, If you want to like more comments like this, make sure you hit that like button. Hit hit that sub button to see more Madden 16 Draft Champions Ultimate Team and Connected Franchise. Make sure you check out that. And I may be live streaming later tonight of Draft Champions and Ultimate Team. And we get Amari Cooper. Definitely going to take that. That's a big weapon for me. And round five. Ooh. 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 We get two Cowboys. Uh, we already have a right guard. So, Zach Martin is, like, the best right guard. But we're going to take Teron Smith for... Look at that offense. We're having a great offensive line. Here yeah, we can get another left tackle. I did have... See, you can go out for Morris. I want to go with Marcus Colson. He's, like, a glitch because he can... He's so tall. So, we're going to take Marcus Colson. Mash him up with Cooper. That's a good one, too. And here we go. We get uh, Mike Adams, William Gay, or linebacker. Um, I'm going to go with William Gay because he not good man coverage. What's his man coverage? He got good zone. What's... Oh. Um, I'm going to go Doomerville. Yeah. You can go anyway, but he has bad man, man coverage, so I'm gonna go different. See, we could go with Justin Forsett. He's a good balance. I really want that LT, so I'm kind of holding on. Um, Julius Adam can really, really be a good slot receiver. We we already have a strong safety, so it can't go much. So I'm gonna go with Forsett because he can do. But if we get LT, well, I'll just move Forsett to the offside. I can usually do. Or we get a left guard. Tied in, big target or center. We do need a left guard. I could be really good, sure of. We go with a big ass tight end. I'm gonna go with all line. You gotta take all line. I feel like that's the best strategy. I'm, I've always gone to quarterbacks and all that stuff. That's what I think I'm getting burned at. But here we go. We get a free safety, middle linebacker, or corner. He's got 87 man as Xavier Rowe. What's his man? 73, but 94 zone. I'm gonna take Rose because look at that man coverage. That could be locked down corner for us. Yeah, it's a smart pick. Ooh. And then we get more playmakers. See, we could get a left in. Or we can go get a... We already have a left outside linebacker. I'm going to look at these two. 91 strength. And then it's blocks 86. I'm going to go Muhammad Wilkerson because he can get off blocks better than Bennett. And in round 12, ooh, we get Foss for it. Every time I take a running back, I always get him. See, we do need a right tackle. And then we would have three weapons at the wide receiver. That'd be dominating weapons. So I'm going to take a right tackle. So now our line is all built up. So now we're hoping we get a quarterback. We have yet to get a quarterback yet. Yet to get a quarterback. And then we get a 85 Andre Smith. See, so we can go with Grisson. Or this is a no-brainer. We're going to take a tight end to burn someone. So now we have weapons. Now we just need a quarterback. Can we please get And not that. I do not want a Ryan Fitzpatrick, so I'm taking the risk, and we'll take a weapon here. Hakeem next, just to have depth, so he'll, he'll be depth. And round 15, are you freaking kidding? What did I say I would do? I would fucking pull LT, and I should have just not drafted four set. You can get L fucking T, or we can have a lockdown right in everyone wants to take lt but since we have four set i don't see no purpose of taking lt but 
We need a good pass rusher. We don't have nothing. We'll have good outside pressure. But look at our offense. It is loaded on the O-line is everything. Wide receiver is done. There's no quarterback. I feel like Forsyth could do something, but LT, you get LT, man. It's, it's over. I want to compare him to Forsyth. All right. He's faster. He can truck better than Forsyth, but we're just going to go with the right end, knowing that's probably the dumbest thing we could have had LT, but... I don't know. I might have made the dumbest choice in my life, but you can never go wrong getting Bruce Smith. You couldn't get LT in any utilization, but we need some pressure on because we didn't take much on our defense. So that's all for the episode. Just to give you a quick update, you can draft now. Flashbacks in Ultimate Team and Draft Champions. So just to let you know that. And this has been your boy King Champ, and I'll see you in the live stream later tonight.